Grant Chaps has gone on television today to say that uh, in line with European countries and other civilised countries, uh, it is expected that if you have a heart attack or a stroke, uh, you should be able to get a um, an ambulance, irrespective of uh, whether there's a strike on or not. Well, he's right about that. The problem is that getting an ambulance has not been frustrated simply because there's a strike on. It's been frustrated because there aren't uh, beds in hospitals. Ambulances are queuing up outside the hospitals. It can take seven, eight hours to get an ambulance if you need one. And that isn't because of strikes. That's because of the chaos in the NHS and the chaos in the management of the NHS. This is about not paying people enough to keep them in their jobs. This is about not having enough people to staff the hospitals. And it's about GPs uh, only working a nine to five uh, hour week. And it's about j just a general failure to understand that illness is not uh, on business times. The illness can strike at any time and our NHS was set up to provide service from cradle to grave and to give us reassurance. It gives us none of that at the moment. And Grant Shapps is trying to deflect and to give the impression that the only problem facing the NHS is striking nurses, striking ambulance staff, uh, striking NHS um, people. Rubbish. Rubbish. We need a reset. We need people. We need to get rid of the management that hasn't done its job. And the government needs to take responsibility for ensuring the NHS works at the point when it is called. Nothing to do with strikes. Strikes are a distraction.